Right, two pieces of good news for you. Uh, if you were one of the 12 million people who religiously tuned in to watch Dempsey and Makepeace every week back in the 80s, one, the series is being repeated, two, the stars of what had to be Britain's most glamorous cops and robbers show, Glynis Barber and Michael Brandon, say that they'd be very interested in making new episodes. Here's how it used to go. seem to care. Or he was told not to. Now, Davis, on the other hand, I'm sure does, even though he doesn't show it. Which may mean he really does care. Have you noticed how Davis reacts every time her name is mentioned? Mm. Stephanie got the fever. Ah, oh, that's sexual chemistry. Uh, <laughs> Michael and Guinness, nice to see you. That's being rerun now on satellite. Uh, so it's a great series. It was fantastic. And it was all the more fascinating for all of us who watched because we knew there was something going on for real. Yes, it was a soap opera all of its own, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> was it? I mean, did you, did you hit it off right from... Didn't you both dislike each other to some extent? Oh, when it was horrible. Met? I was horrible. Horrible he was. <laughs> Why was he horrible? I loathed him. What, sort of full of himself, an American? Oh, he was terribly American. Are we going to take sides here? Is that <laughs> yes. what's going to happen? Girls okay, girls you got to sit over there. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was a yank, wasn't he? Over here, over he there. Was. He was, and I'd only worked with one before. I'd never been to America or met many Americans, really. Yeah. And I'd only, I'd done one film with an American who shall be nameless, and it was a horrific experience. And yeah. when they said, you're going to be doing this series with an American, yeah. And everyone said, oh, don't worry, I'm not, you know, not all Americans are like that. And then I went to meet him at the, the Ritz Hotel, and I came back to my boyfriend that I was living with, and he said, well, how was he? I said, he, he's my worst nightmare come true. He's exactly, <laughs> you know, what I was dreading. Hear, basically, yeah. <laughs> I think so, on some subconscious level, see, yeah. our inner beings knew. Uh, she, was, yeah. she was fighting it. That was it, you know what I mean? You were in and denial. So, yeah. Part, yeah. Yeah. And all that happened. So, but did you know as soon as you saw her then, or did you...? Well, actually, um, I found an old journal. Because mm -hmm. when I, I came over here, I sort of like said, okay, I'm coming over to 11 hours of mm. this show. I didn't know I was going to be here for seven years, you know. And, <laughs> and um, we met, and I, I, I found this old journal. I read it, and I said, huh, oh, good looking. I like it. She's got a spark. And then I said, watch out. Yeah. It wrote this watch out and really? I underlined it, you know. Is really? Yeah, found it years later. So, uh, something spot. So, how long did it, wasn't it a night, a night out at the theatre with mutual friends that started to, to build a, a, a kind of personal bond between you? Well, yes, about, it was about, that was about a year later, though. Yeah. And, well, well, I had this boyfriend that I was living with and then we broke up. And uh, so he asked me to go to the theatre one night, so I... I did? I went with him. <laughs> and oh, because you you're, you're on screen doing Dempsey and Makepeace. I mean, the press must have gone, the paparazzi must have gone mad seeing you two out Well, together. they did. The oh. first time they, they saw us together, they just sort of couldn't believe it. You know, yeah, this is yeah, too good to be amazing. true. Yeah. So, um... So, where yeah. was the first kiss? Oh. Well, I'll tell you what, I was in the back my, of the My here, memory... Okay, so there we are. Shared with you. Yeah. Shared with us, all right? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't remember, No, she actually. can't remember. Well, I remember is this. We... She hated my guts. When we left to go do the American well, now, hold tour... Hold on, I would like to actually vet the story first. You want, you want to hear it first? <laughs> no, no, yes. No, I, we'll discuss it. We'll tell you afterwards. We can argue about it later. See, we never agree on anything. Yeah. I think that's where it's... You know, that's yeah. what it all started. See, yeah. when we get all these scripts, um, they were written for originally for a Dempsey, James Dempsey III. The original yeah. character American was a ca rich American. Right. When I read this, I said, this, the idea could be great, but this is not, you know, and so we met, and I told him my idea for this, and why, if I, you know, was to do this, this is how I think it should be, a real, yeah. a guy from the gutter, diamond in the rough, they meet, Lady Harriet, and so... Yeah, because, mm. yeah, because you, your character <coughs> is very, very upper crust. Yeah. So they Proper, came back yeah. from the airport mm. and said, let's talk about that again, and that's how it changed. When I got here, they handed me all these scripts that had already been written. Yeah. See, so I, I, I was changing a lot of the dialogue which was like pulling up in front of this stately home, this castle, I don't know, was hers. I don't know, she's a lady, you know, and I said, whoa, look at this, you know. 
If I lived in those days, I'd have been a knight in shining armor. She goes, Dempsey, if you lived in those days, you'd be shining the armor at night. You know? <laughs> and, and, and she goes, well, it needs another life. I said, what do you mean? It works fine. No, it doesn't. And we get into these things, you see. Yeah. Anyway, by the end of the first series, we really hated each other. I was telling the, the director, I said, you know, really, well, no, you've got to get rid of her. Excuse you've got to get rid of her. I hated you. You were crazy about that's me. That's right. That's right. Okay. She hated me. <laughs> so I'm saying, like, listen, get rid of her. He says, we're working on it. We're working on it. Meanwhile, I'd walk out of the office and he goes, yes, this is all working so well, you know? The dynamics on screen. Anyway, we go to tour America. The show's going to... Now, this you know, is the story I actually want to bet. <laughs> Oh, come I on. Want to get Please give, it. Just give us the headlines. Just give us a bulletin. No, you can't she's leave. like you. It's just the same, actually. It's I mean, a very I'm innocent like story. Well, no, no and I'm all not, and I don't want to talk about it. All right, OK. Something... something so, uh, okay. so... Something... Going happened. shopping later? I mean, we're... <laughs> Cool. That's great. No, no. We'll all right, something happened. Us. Something happened in America. We don't know what. There was, a, there was a click of some description, and it all went off from there. Um, why did you stop making the series? Because it was, it, it was a hit. I mean, you know, it finished high. What, what happened? What, well, why I, did you I, leave we, it? we had three year contracts, uh, yeah. which finished. And um, it was a co production with Tribune in America. And then, as far as I can remember, Tribune were very keen to sort of make some more. And uh, LWT said, well, you know, thank you very much. It's the end of your contract. And it was, it was a bit bizarre, actually. I was editing the last I episode, never which I directed, hmm. when London's Burning was moving in. Yeah. To the, you know, the, and what the, year was that? 1987? 86, I think. 86, 87. I think it was 87. What a shame. And, um, we, you know, and everybody wanted to go on. The crew had become a family. We, you know, in fact, um, uh, uh, the, my driver called yesterday. You know, we still have contact. I'm godparents, you know, godparent mm. to his mm. children. And um, it, it's like we, we were family. Yes. Uh, and everybody wanted to carry on. Everybody wanted to, you know, go for, forward with this. Well, but, I wasn't uh, to be in, and you went to L.A. How did you like L.A.? You had a baby. Well, a baby um, yes, I did. I, we, we actually went, we, well, th that was a, about five years or four years <coughs> later, you know, yeah. once we'd got married. Yeah. And... Uh, Michael said, well, you know, I, I'd like to just go to L.A. for a, a few months for pilot season. Mm. And he said, why? And we, we were in the process of sort of selling our, ver our two places and getting a place together. And uh, we hadn't found a place. He said, you know, put everything in storage and we'll go for five months. And I thought, well, I don't like the sound of that, putting everything <laughs> into storage. But anyway, I did. You didn't bet that one. And five years later, we came back because he got a pilot. So he yeah, was under yeah. contract for about... 18 months right. and then in that 18 months I got pregnant yeah and began to nest yeah I started nesting and I sort of couldn't move you like you like being a mother don't you um, I love being a yeah, mother you yes. very cocooned yes how old is the baby now he's uh, four four but you were you were a bit concerned about him have we got a picture of him no Oh, never mind. You were a bit concerned about him growing up with an American accent, weren't you? Uh, well, it was beginning like to bother dad, me. Like his dad. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want him to be a yank. Anyway, but he is. We, we arrived back in England and he, he'd sort of run into so the So we got to New York on this tour, <laughs> thing. She wouldn't talk to me in New York. Excuse me. Excuse we, me. we got to Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. I want to know. I we took a walk in Chicago. It's not that interesting. It's all cool. We had dinner, right? Yeah. And then yeah. we got to LA. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And we had a kiss goodnight. That's now, what's wrong really. with that? Is that it? That's all right. That's all right. Oh, I think it was vetted. I think he, I think he performed Censored. his own surgery on that. Yeah. Censored. <laughs> all right. so, so you're back here to live now, anyway, the two yeah. of you. That, yeah. that's I mean, we, 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 people keep saying, well, you know, why, why have you come back? And I, I said, well, I only went for five months. It just took me five years to get yeah. back. It was, well, there's yeah. been a flurry. I mean, the, the interest is still there. There's been a flurry of stories about you in the papers now you're back, you know. And and you're, oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Goodness, I haven't there seen was, them. There's one this morning in the Daily Mirror. Oh, really? One, this, one this very morning. Can we, can we bet eh? this? Can we Are we bet together? This? No, 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 celebrating <laughs> the fact that it's back on screen. On, oh, right, right. Is, it, is it the Granada Sky Channel? Yeah. Oh, well, that's <laughs> another reason for being here. Um, yeah. But yeah, it's true. It's, it's getting a lot of attention. We, but just before we started, Judy said, oh, your hair. <laughs> what, it, what was that? Was that a was Well, that a bob it was a sort of bob, I suppose. It was sort of shorter at the back and yeah. sort of came longer in the front. And it, it was just a bit shaggy because I used yeah. to sort of scrunch it up and everything. You were the first one to have that look. I remember because everybody, everybody used everyone to copy it. Everyone tried to copy, copy it. it. But now when I look back, 
at it. It, mm. it looked like it sort of looked like a thatched roof. To no, me. no, 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 no. It's <laughs> like, I can't imagine that everyone was trying to copy it. It was it, it was the Harriet cut, like the Rachel cut. You know, it says that yeah. you're the Jennifer Anstis of your time. Everyone Aye, did you, did. Yeah. you both yeah. look, considering the last one was made, you reckon in '86, you say '87. Never mind. <laughs> you both look incredibly well. Is that LA? I mean, oh, is that, is that yeah. life on the West Coast? Going to bed at six o'clock, yeah, drinking yeah. Perrier water and nothing but. Because you're not allowed to drink, are you, in, in California? No, uh, no smoking, no drinking, smoking. And you have to leave. That's yes, it. and. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's I been too heavily vetted. Going actually to <laughs> Idaho once, and they had an Arctic freeze there, mm. and it was like 70 below zero, and it was all the people from LA go up, you know, for the ski season. Yeah. <laughs> I said, if you want to smoke, you have to smoke outside. And there were three people out there like this. They, they couldn't even get the cigarettes in their mouth. Hey, that's uh -huh. like that's at our office. <coughs> our office is up some steps. And you can't smoke inside. Every time we go back there after the program, they're all out there on the steps. Well, you have to kind of wait. They look like back ladies. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll try that in minus 40 yeah. degrees. Yeah, so afternoon. what are you doing? Are you, are you both uh, working at the moment, or are you just casting around looking for stuff? Because you've only been here for well, we, well, a few we months. Well, we keep getting cast together since we got back, which is quite peculiar. The omen, I guess, for our return was I got a call from this director to do this. Uh, motion picture. She got a call to do this uh, big American miniseries, yeah. and then they called and said, "Would I be in the miniseries?" And she said, "No, no, no, no. We're not doing that. <laughs> We're not doing that." Then the director called and said, "Would you be wife. in the film?" And she said, "Well." So all right. So we did yeah. these simultaneously, going from set to set. Yeah. It was terrific. Weird. It's all that sexual chemistry, you see. That's why you cast together. <laughs> it's quite clear. It's sort of bubbling away there between you still. Listen, it's lovely to see you both. Good to see Thank you. Thank you very yeah. much indeed. Thank you very uh, when, much. I don't, know when the, I don't know when it starts. Can somebody give me the information? As usual, I've forgotten. It's being brainless. I, I think what? it's running on Granada Plus now. Right now. It's starting at 5 and oh, 10 yeah. every day. There's, it's it's on, on in the afternoon and then it's on later as That's well, right. in the evenings as well. Okay, good. So, Thank well, you. I loved it. It was huge fun. It's such a good series. Oh, it was. It's great. You know? Thanks a lot. Yeah, yeah. really yeah. great, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So. Yeah, this is good see. fun. Hey, if you ever take yeah. a holiday, maybe we could do this. <laughs> we could try this for a week or two. <laughs> That's cool. Or maybe we could act. Maybe we could make our fortunes in a huge detective well, Maybe There you go. Maybe you the Bob, you get the guy. I don't think so. Thanks, goodness. Thanks very much, Michael. It's nice to see you. And it's now time for our. Our new consumer series, which is called Test Drive, and today Nina Mishkov and uh, bread actress. G